So for this top section, you're going to pull each section forward, just the same way we did the first. And you'll see when I'm finished, it gives a lot of interesting texture and movement throughout the sides of the hair. Sometimes when we're making the hair from straight to curly, it's all moving in the same direction. It's very flat and kind of boring. This is just updating that a little bit. So this is our finished blowout. Remember what we did first was we pre-dried the hair, so we got the majority of the moisture out, maybe 80 or 90 percent. Then what we did is we went and we sectioned off our sections just to keep it really easy for us. So we did this mohawk section in the front. That would leave out the side two parts, which you did all in one curl. And then everything that's from behind the ears back, you just broke into larger sections and pulled straight out to the side so that you could easily blow dry them. And then we finished with this top section, which remember we blew forward and back for each section. So no matter how far back on the head it was, the motion is exactly the same. And you can see that gave us all this beautiful texture and movement right along the sides. One of the greatest things about having curly hair is a nice blowout should last you a couple of days just because you don't tend to get as oily around the root. So enjoy your blowout.